This is an example of the restoration process used to transfer 8mm film that is to be archived. Like the famous film shot by Abraham Zeebruder of the assassination of President Kennedy in 1963, this film was also shot on Kodak 8mm colour film. Amateur cinematographer Wally Craven captured these images on the 18th of November 1947 at Ballantyne's department store in Christchurch, New Zealand. It still remains the worst fire in New Zealand's history and the images are obviously of great historic value for both the fire service and the various archives. Not only was Wally first on the scene, but also his footage was in colour at a time when almost all film was in black and white. This was the early days of home movies and colour stock of that period had very heavy contrast. Given the extremes between the light and dark areas of the image and the small frame area of 8mm film, this was obviously going to be a difficult film to transfer. Because of the immense importance of this film, it was copied to 16mm in the 1980s, but by that time it had been projected several times, as you can see from the scratches and emulsion damage. So you are now looking at the 16mm version of the original 8mm film. By the time this copy was made in 1987, the film had already been projected many times and that damage is visible on the copy. So in transferring the original film, we had to take great care. The film was not cleaned in the traditional method, but run through sticky rollers to remove any surface dirt. Now, have a look at the scratches. They have almost disappeared. Well, in fact, they haven't. They are still there. The scratch concealment and enhancement facilities within our telecine suite are very good. Although the 16mm copy captured most of the detail within the picture, the high precision optics of our telecine machine gave a much better interpretation. This restoration was commissioned in order to preserve New Zealand's historic images.